We're going to jump off board with the bob carrier. It is TP. Ace is going to lead the charge into A, and he's going to get more. Trying to get in here, Ace pops out. They're hopefully going to get this bomb down, and they do get it down. A 3v2 situation. They are set up in A. This is going to be difficult for Impact to try to get in here, knock all these guys out, and get it abused. Time is dwindling down on the clock. Impact's face lies in the line here. As complexity is trying to be crowned, your Anaheim champions, it can happen here in 23 seconds. Grim 6 and Ace have the front on the clock. TP, watch the play. and impact just falls off the pro and complexity is crowned with winners. Good sportsmanship from everybody across the board. Gotta give it up to impact. One of the most impressive runs in the history of Call of Duty. What this team has accomplished has been one for the esports history books. However, at some point, the heroes on the ball and the complexity is now with the They are crowned the winners and they are fired up a hard fought battle between these two teams. Back and forth they went. Just such evenly matched and sound squads. You can't ask for anything more. The crowd here that showed up. 21,000 people and attendance across the board at MLG Anaheim. And all the people that just came out here to support the Call of Duty movement. You've got to give them all the love in the world. There's some celebrities out here, some YouTubers out here, with great, great fans that showed up to meet everybody. And at the end of the day, it was complexity that pulls out a, such a huge win against Impact. And we're about to go back to the floor here as this team is grouping up together. They're just trying to catch their breath. Let's send it down. I think Chris Puckett, are you ready, my man? I am, my friend. I am down here on the floor with the Captain Ace and the MLG Spring Champions Complexity. You had a tough road to your first win in 2013. You were one game away from finishing in the top three at NLG Dallas for a winner championships. One game away from getting top three at the Call of Duty Championships in Hollywood. Now, you picked up a new player for this event in Clayster. You guys played with all new energy and you are the champions. How are you feeling right now? You're doing the dirty work all weekend long, but I gotta know, who is the team going to crown the MVP? That's a tough one. Let's give it to my blue boy, Blake. going on guys my name is Asian Psycho and as you guys can probably hear my voice is voice is shot again not as bad as it was last night though last night was really bad um, it wasn't completely lost but you could definitely tell that there was something wrong with my voice 
Now, this time, I, well, I can hear my voice kind of kind of strained, but it wasn't as, nowhere near as bad as it was last night. Uh, anyways, so right now is the end of day three of MLG uh, Anaheim. I had a blast here. Uh, for $50, it was pretty fucking awesome. I mean, free Dr. Pepper. I mean, I wasn't, I'm not a huge Dr. Pepper fan, but after, after you know, drinking a couple Dr. Pepper cherries, I don't mind it so much anymore. Um, they were giving out fucking free, uh, those flips, those, you know, chocolate covered pretzels or something like that, so you could get as many of those you wanted to, so technically speaking, you never really had to buy anything, uh, food-wise or drink-wise. You could practically live off those things there. And, um, yeah, uh, watched a lot of StarCraft, but mainly Call of Duty, because Call of Duty is what I, uh, went there for, uh, for primarily. I just watched StarCraft, uh, any matches that I could find, uh, while, you know, there weren't any COD matches going on. And... As for League of Legends, like, what the fuck is League of Legends, right? So, I think Pult won the uh, MLG Anaheim, which is which is very nice because I he I heard that uh, uh put with that with that win today, uh Pult com completed his like three the triple crown I think it was called, uh where he wins like three tournaments I guess I don't know what the other two are but one of them is obviously MLG Anaheim so he was able to do that. Uh, the StarCraft two uh, crowd was going fucking nuts. Uh, when he did win, so that's pretty fucking amazing. Um, let's see who, what, what else. Uh, Complexity finally dethroned uh, Impact because Impact up till now has been just fucking dominating the entire uh, Call of Duty scene. Uh, I mean, fuck, hell, they won uh, Dallas, they won EGL, they won uh, Caught Champs, none, uh, no less. And what else did they win? I thought that I think they won another event too, but I'm probably forgetting. Anyways, so they've been winning everything now, but finally Complexity has now, uh, you know, knocked them off their throne, so to speak. So that's really nice. Uh, you know, lots of people hate Impact because you know they're they're a fucking cocky ass team. You know, their players are really bad mannered in StarCraft two turns, but I don't mind. I mean, Impact's a really fucking good team. No one, you can't say that they're a bad team. I mean, if, if you want to call them bad because, you know, they trash talk a lot, then, well, I guess fuck you. Because I, like, I feel like if you're skilled enough at a game to a point where you can win three, you know, major tournament titles in a row, then, you know, you have, you have a right to trash talk. I mean, it also spices up the game a lot more. It makes it a lot more enjoyable to to watch. Cause I mean, hell, we all we all love a little bit of drama here or there, don't we? Now, as humans, so yeah. Uh, complexity. Sorry for the low lighting settings, by the way. This camera is really bad, like I said. Uh, but anyways, complexity finally managed to uh, kick off impact off their COD throne. So now they have won. Uh, currently, anyway, they're the best uh, team playing Black Ops 2 at the moment. The next event for MLG is going to be at Columbus uh, 24th to, uh, or 22nd to 24th. If I'm not mistaken, that should be the week of Thanksgiving, so will I be able to watch it? I'll definitely watch it. Uh, obviously, I have no plans on actually attending the damn event. God forbid. I really do want to now, now that I've been to an MLG event uh, but here at Anaheim, but um, I mean, that's Anaheim is a place that I can, you know, drive to at least. It's very accessible, so um, yeah, I had a like I said, had a fucking blast here. Uh, voice is completely shot, but that's a small price to pay. It'll come back within a day or anyway. So, uh, lots of cool gear. Uh, I bought this jersey that has my uh, that has my username on it. So, yay! I tried fitting Toho Sniper 98 on there, but uh, there, there weren't enough spaces, so I just had to go with the Asian Cycle one. So, yeah. Right now, I'm just about to drive off. Uh, drive off home. It's about 8:30 right now. Uh, last night was really hectic. I spent like two hours driving around because I got lost. Yeah, I'm real smart printing out directions on how to get here and not how to go back. Smart me, aren't I? Sure proves why I'm fucking Asian. Anyways, so now that I do have an idea of how to get back home, I should be able to get back faster anyway. I have a test to study for tomorrow. So, yeah. Uh, I'll be I'll be giving my uh, whole thoughts on you know Anaheim, MLG Anaheim and, and general once I actually get home. But for now, I just want to say I had a really fun time here and uh, I really like to come back. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. See you.